17 year old Indiana boy is now charged with the murders of two other teenagers during a drug deal. CBS 2's Chelsea Irving is live at the Porter County Jail with troubling details of what happened to the teens who've been missing for a week, Chelsea. Rob, that 17 year old suspect is behind bars behind me tonight in jail. He has been denied bond this morning. He pleaded not guilty to two counts of murder. Prosecutors say in a teenage drug deal, he shot and beat to death two other teens, then burned their bodies in a car. Police say it was an anonymous source who led them to the bodies of 19 year old Molly Lanham of St. John and 18 year old Thomas Grill Jr. of Cedar Lake. Their bodies found in southern Porter County after the pair had been missing for a week. Prosecutors say 17 year old Connor Kerner of Valparaiso was meeting Thomas Grill to buy drugs at Kerner's grandparents' home in Hobart. We found these court records indicating past drug offenses by Thomas Grill. Molly Lanham, though, was with Grill just along for the ride. Investigators say Kerner told a friend during the drug deal in a garage. Grill tried to rob him, so he pulled out his grandfather's gun and started firing. The first two shots missed. The third hit Grill, but did not kill him. Court documents say Grill fell to the ground, begging for his life. Kerner advised that he panicked due to being out of bullets in the gun. Kerner then beat him with a pipe wrench until he died. Prosecutors say Kerner then got Molly Lanham, showed her Grill's body, and threatened to kill her if she said anything, but then shot her when she turned around. Kerner then put the bodies in the trunk of Grill's Honda Civic, loaded it with flammable liquids, drove the car a few miles away to a wooded area where he set it on fire. Investigators say Kerner bragged to their anonymous source that he knew how to hide a body because he had done it before. Kerner was a student at Valparaiso High School. A check of his criminal records shows only some moving violations. This never happens around here, so people are definitely very, very surprised. Molly Lanham was a recent graduate of Hanover Central High School, where she ran track and played soccer. A family spokesperson told us, quote, Molly was so unapologetically herself. She was spunky, fashionable, and unique in every imaginable way. Molly will be remembered for her love and kindness for all, especially animals. Prosecutors tell us that Kerner had planned to put the bodies and the car into a U-Haul and drive that to somewhere along the Mississippi River and dump the bodies in the car in the Mississippi River. He has been denied bond, so he will remain behind bars here. His next court date is set for May. Reporting live in Valparaiso, Chelsea Irving, CBS2 News.